This round, I just want to see heavy punches. Let it go. Big punch. Yes, 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 yes. What a bruise. Let's go, baby, let's go. That boxing damage. They love it. Beautiful work today. You did awesome. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That punch damaged him, right? Power. I love it. Let's go. Don't stop now. You got 30 seconds. Great. Hey, great. Great boxing damage. Okay? Good job. All right. Now that's some sweet science. Today, I want to see you sharp and quick. Keep working there. Next opponent is going to be no match for you.
I want to see good technique and form this round. seconds. All right, some sweet science. Let's go. Ooh, huge punch. That was huge. That must have hurt. I like that. More of that, okay? Don't worry about today. There's always tomorrow. Good job. Yes, devastating punch. Great job. seconds. Let's go.
All right, coming up next, it's a UFC light heavyweight division collision. Here he is, for my money, Michael, the most well-rounded fighter in this division, a true mixed martial artist at his core, and he believes he'll have a lot of advantages in this matchup tonight. Everyone talked about him being well-rounded. It's unbelievable to watch a guy that can do everything across the board at such a high level. Yeah, he's comfortable wherever the fight goes. Maybe he'll grapple tonight, maybe he'll strike. Makes him a hard guy to prepare for. All right, so here he is, the consensus greatest mixed martial arts athlete of all time, UFC light heavyweight champion John Jones. It has been a remarkable career. The toughest fight he has had came against you. He is trying to add to his legacy here tonight in what is yet another big spot for Johnny Bones. John Jones is a guy that has reached the true pinnacle of mixed martial arts. No matter what he was going through outside of the octagon, the moment he stepped foot in there, he was just the best of the very best. I've shared the octagon with him twice, and I have never felt that I was getting attacked by so many different things. He's a phenomenal mixed martial artist, truly deserves to go down in the UFC Hall of Fame. A champion now was a champion before, one of the longest reigns in UFC light heavyweight history. And it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it as well as he does that 84-inch reach, certainly one of many tools in the vast arsenal of Johnny Bones Jones. Our tale of the tape for this light heavyweight tilt. Jones is 13 years the elder. He will have a nine inch reach advantage. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC light heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a Muay Thai kickboxer and Jiu Jitsu fighter, holding a professional record of. Nine wins, no losses. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of New York, New York, Mr. Untouchable. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a look-see-do fighter, holding a professional record of 27 wins, three losses, and one no contest. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, presenting the former UFC light heavyweight champion, John Bones! Jones! And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. So Dan Mergliata shares the cage. Ready? Round one, shades of Vitor Belfort circa 2013 for this young man. He's won his last three fights, all of them by vicious knockout. Let's we'll see if he can keep it going here tonight. All right, here we go, early round one. We talk about wrestling being a great equalizer in MMA, but length and reach is another one. He's got a great jab. We'll see if he can employ it tonight. You have got to be born with it, right? You don't get taller. When you're a tall guy, you have to understand Make your skill set match your physical abilities. And this guy has done this tremendously. Effective strike there by Jones. Both guys throwing potential fight enders here in the early going. Archer, there's the only takedown. Pretty evident, DC, that he wants to get this fight to the ground, and he was certainly able to do so there. He felt like he had a massive advantage in the wrestling. And if he attempted takedown, he was Let's see what he does in this position. Well, he continues to manhandle him here on the ground. Both fighters get up now. That knee might have landed there. And now trying to take the back. And now he's got that tie clinch. We'll see what he can do with it. Oh, he's got it going now. Nice hip tosses him down. Now we'll see if he can advance position. I mean, right into side control. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. 
And he's back up again. So the takedowns have been there, as have the Dedos. Oh, nice elbow. A good right hand right there. <sighs> nice kick. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Just misses with the right hook. 26 total strikes have landed for Johnny Bones. Take down, cut, take down, cut. Over and over, he's securing these takedowns. Oh, nice job using his strength there to posture up. We'll see what he can do now. He's gonna start looking to land big shots from the top. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Trying to kick the leg out. Oh, beautiful take down by him there as he lands another one. He's keeping the stat guys busy tonight. Huh? I mean, over and over, take down the tip after take down the tip, and the cardio. The cardio to wrestle that much is so impressive because his opponent is getting back to his feet, but he's got this ability to continue to chase takedowns. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back in range. Oh, nice job to block the kick. I mean, he's cutting down the side with these beautiful leg kicks. You can't take many of those, you better check. Oh, beautiful strike attempt there as he lands the hook. Beautiful hook. Really did a great job of keeping his back hand on his chin, throwing that hook, and putting it exactly where he needed to go. All right, so maybe he goes for another takedown here, and it's the setups, too, right? He's not blindly shooting from the outside. Maybe he'll get him down. He, oh, goes to the ankle pick now to get him down, DC. We'll see how he chooses to proceed from here. Got the... You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness even be on his feet right now. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Oh, man, look how quickly he gets that foot to the target. Oh, nice connection with that punch. It's one thing to have an edge in reach. It's another to take advantage. Nicely done. Just out of range with that right hook. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on your chin take down. There you go. Oh, slams his opponent to the ground. All right, bottom fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape, DC. Now, the guy's attacking the triangle. He finds... Oh, and there's the horn at the end of the round. How about this fight, folks? You see, he was nearly caught in a submission there right at the end of the round. Save. Let's get to round two. Oh, he's had a big knee to the body. We'll see if he can follow up. Big head kick lands. Nice. Oh, he's unable to find the target with that uppercut. Nice entry there as he gets another takedown, and I know his opponent has confidence in his ability to get back up, but I got an idea. How about don't get taken down in the first How place? How about defend yourself over and over you're getting taken down? You're losing the fight. You've got to change something. And for the offensive wrestler, just continue down the path. Right. Working. Back and forth we go. Head kick partially blocked. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. Oh, nice connection there by John Jones, and he is fighting with a definite killer instinct here tonight. And you have to have it, because the target's always on your back when you're the UFC champion. Jones seems desperate to keep that title right around the 
and he connects there with a punch. So pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. Well, body left. What? A double leg takedown attempt here, and that one is true. Nice job there to enter and ultimately plant his opponent on the mat. Now what does he do? That he's got his best shot off, finish the attack. Where does he go now to the top position? Look at the whip action that comes from this whole neck. Oh, combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. Man. And every one of them are landing, overwhelming him with different attacks. Just missed with the left there. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace, Jones. He gets another takedown here. Good sign for him here. Back to the feet now. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. there, huge block. Well, he had a lot of success with his takedowns in the previous round, and there it is again. So the adjustments in the opposite corner have not been made. Has not paid dividends. Once again, he finds the angle, he gets to the leg, and he scores another takedown. Great job by this guy. Dig and kick. Just misses there with the left. And that one certainly found the target. All right, so another swing and a miss. And oh, Jones gets another takedown. He's one of the better takedown artists in this featherweight division. Useful strike there. The ground and pound on point tonight. All right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. Oh, that's the quick bus score. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Nice job staying busy here on the clinch. Coming up next, it's a UFC light heavyweight division collision. Round 
on shades of Vitor Belfort circa 2013 for this young man. He's won his last three fights, all of them by vicious knockout. We'll see if he can keep it going here tonight. Oh, man, how is he standing? Brutal knee to the body. Oh, nice land there with the punch. You see, he's taking advantage of what is an obvious edge and reach. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Oh, nice connection there by John Jones, and he is fighting with a definite killer instinct here tonight, DC. And you have to have it, because the target's always on your back when you're the UFC champion. Jones seems destined to keep that title wrapped around. All right, so there it is, the early takedown. He told everyone here during fight week within earshot that he was gonna try to wrestle, try to get this fight to the ground, and had no problem doing so just then. During their fight camp, they made a checklist. They checked off the most important part of the fight, getting an early takedown. Now looking to do something with that left arm. He's isolating the Kimura attack. Notice he'll pick up his left leg, step over the head. Once he gets him on his side, he'll start to apply pressure to try to get the finish. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent, you gotta be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. Good movement by him here, transitioning very well on the ground tonight. Step for step, he's staying with his opponent in every transition. Fighters back to their feet here. Went for the inside leg kick. Telegraph that spinning back fist. Ooh, what a punch. A little single collar tie there. Driving the back of the head, pulling forward on the head, and then landing a beautiful punch. Oh, man, look at that. Picture perfect. Oh, nice guillotine there. There it is. And this might just be a matter of time. Beautifully executed there on the ground. So there's the horn. That means it's the end of the round. And get that man a singlet, man, right? Offensive wrestling on point tonight. That was a tutorial. That was every single takedown you could secure in a fight. He did it all the right way. He's beating his opponent to the finish before he can try to sprawl and respond. He's a step behind. If he's gonna stop these takedowns going forward, he needs to react a little quicker. All right, so a wild round and a wild sequence there on the ground, DC. Talk us through the highlight. He's such a phenomenal grappler. I don't understand how people don't know that this guy wants to submit you. He is the best grappler, best submission specialist we've seen in a long time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 25 seconds of the very first round. For the winner by submission, Mr. Atomar. All right, so there he is, all smiles, and rightfully so, after he gets the job done by submission tonight. You told me off the air before the fight that he was going to submit him, and that's exactly what happened. Man. I mean, you know this guy has such a great submission game that you cannot lay in his guard, and his opponent is known to lay in the guard. He made him pay for it tonight and got the submission victory.
All right. I want to see you kill it today. Let's go in there and crush it. That's how you block! Man, your next opponent is gonna be no match for you. Oh, nice punch! Nice punch! He felt that one. Punch, big punch. I love it. I love it. That'll leave a bruise. Come on. You've got 30 seconds. Let's go. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That punch damaged him, right? Power. I love it. Let's go. That's what I like to see. Good, clean, crisp punches. Okay, time to work. Let's go. Great speed on that combo. More of that. Let's go. Dominated today. Good work. Today, let's go in there and get after it. Beautiful. Keep grinding!
champion's train. You got 20 seconds. Nice work. Just keep drilling that. Never kick without setting it up with a jab or... Fast, smooth, strong. That's what we're doing today. Nice defense! Hey, today wasn't your best day, but tomorrow will be better. Fast, smooth, strong. That's what we're doing today. Nice defense! You're following directions perfectly. Great job. Use combos. You got it. Seconds. Let's go. <laughs> nice boxing. Yes. Nice boxing. Now, just keep building up that damage. Let me see that. Let's go. That's what I like. All right, let's see what you got today. Speed and power, that's it. Nice kickboxing, all right? We're building up that damage. Here we go. Yeah, yeah, more of that. I like it, big kicks.
Ready? Let's go. Yup, yup. I like it. I like it. Those kicks are adding up. legs, take them down, and get on top. All right? Good, good. He can't get you down. Man, your next opponent is gonna be no match for you. Beautiful combination. I love it. Pump it up. Put the pressure on him. Hey, hey, make him work harder for those takedowns. Got it? Seconds left. Come on. Perfect. Nice. Nice work today. That was some good control from the top. From there, you can dictate. Okay, time to work. Let's go. Nice block! Man, your next opponent is gonna be no match for you. Oh, nice punch! Nice punch. He felt that one. Nice punch. Nice punch. 
Spelled that one. And 30 to go. Beautiful combination. I love it. Keep it up. Put the pressure on him. job today. Better than last time, and it'll be better next time. Okay, come on now. Let's get in there and get after it today. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Huge cake. That must hurt. All right, let's get in there. Let's push yourself today. Let's see what you got. There we go. Hey, he can't get in on you. Man, your next opponent is gonna be no match for you. Nice work! Nice timing on that takedown. Uh-huh. 30 to go. Show me. Combo. Keep at it. Ha 
Nice. Your wrestling base is getting stronger. Let's keep drilling. Keep working. All right, coming up next, it's a UFC light heavyweight division collision. All right, here he is, Sweden's best, the former two-time UFC light heavyweight title challenger, Alexander Gustafsson, certainly a guy who gave you a fight in Houston back in the day. That was the fight of the night at UFC 192, and I know taught you a lot about yourself as a fighter. Yes, I learned a lot of lessons in that fight against Gustafsson, but you look at Alexander, and people want to question whether or not he has the durability, the toughness to overcome insurmountable odds. Trust me, he does. He has fantastic footwork, underrated wrestling, in very, very good boxing. 
a very smart guy who trains out of the All-Stars Academy out in Sweden, has great coaching, and it shows every time he steps foot in the octagon. Yeah, he hinted at retirement a few years ago, but his head and his heart seem to be in the right place. Alexander Gustafson looking to prove a point here tonight. Well, always exciting when this guy shows up on the fight card, Daniel. He is a true mixed martial artist. Not really any glaring weaknesses, at least, that he's put on film thus far. He's the new breed of fighter. Those kids that start doing everything at six years old. They start wrestling. They start doing jujitsu. They start to box. He's one of those guys that has every one of those skills, and he does them all at an A-plus level. He's got tremendous cardio. He is the type of fighter that in a few years will just litter the UFC roster across the board. And oftentimes his opponents will say he doesn't really do anything special, but he does everything at a plus level, and he believes he'll have a lot of advantages in this matchup tonight. Our tale of the tape for this light heavyweight tilt. Gustafson is 13 years the elder. He will have a four-inch reach advantage. All right, now to get us started, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC light heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 19 wins, 10 losses. He stands six feet five inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Stockholm, Sweden, Alexander the Molar Gustafsson. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. A Muay Thai kickboxer and jiu-jitsu fighter, holding a professional record of 10 wins, no losses. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of New York, New York, Mr. Untouchable. And with the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. So Dan Mergliata shares the cage. You ready? So on the strength of a big win by submission his last time out, we'll see if this young man can keep it going here tonight. Round one is underway. Dominant performance his last time out to extend the winning streak and to set up this massive, massive opportunity tonight. We'll see if he can take advantage. Oh, really using his reach advantage there as he lands the punch, DC. All right, he engages in a single collar side. Right hand punch to the clinch. So pretty impressive work by him here against the fence, not just staying busy, but staying accurate as well. Staying very accurate, active, making those strikes matter. Oh, nice job to land a knee to the bottom. Oh, man, I wish I was out tall. Oh, and he lands another huge knee there as the taller fighter uses his length well yet again. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the judge. So both guys landing at will here. Good action early. He's doing a really good job of getting on that high cross and just following the action. Back to his feet. A oh, little single collar tie there. Big knee lands right to the opponent's midsection. And they separate. A beautiful head kick. Big call from the West Lands. Now he gets back to the ring. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Now goes in and secures the takedown. Back to the feet. Big kick lands. Oh, massive kick. Everything behind it. Nice defense there, huge block. Gustafson gets yet another takedown. Well, he's up, but he is hurting for certain. The finish could come at any time. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Oh, nice elbow. Big kick land. An uppercut landed. Outstanding output on both sides. Go back up, push forward. Oh, and there's another uppercut. DC, you got pretty good. 
good uppercut. I'm not sure it's as good as his, but pretty good. Oh, double leg. Well, he's up, but oh, is he hurt. Such a fast leg kick. Telestrator tonight, but we're gonna get you some highlights from this one. This was a fight that had it all, and for my money, his best performance to date. His best performance to date in the biggest moment. In the biggest moments, you gotta show up, and that's exactly what he did tonight. He used every bit of his skill to get the job done. The decision is inside the octagon. It resides with Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliato has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 14 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Mr. Untouchable. Well, he's smiling ear to ear, and why not after a knockout like that? I need to take it to the after party tonight. I mean, this is what dreams are made of. You dream of the knockout like this, and then the party after, where you and all your coaches get to celebrate the great handiwork.
EA Sports. It's in the game. Gentlemen, protect yourselves at all times. Let's touch up. Remember, stick and move. That's it. That's it. Stay away from that power hand, okay? 
keep circling away from that power. You need just to keep moving side to side, all right? Just battle. 
can't let this guy throw first. He can't be first. If he throws first, he's able to set that power shot. Punch now, champ. No doubt about it. You're losing this fight. You need to throw and land a big shot and knock this guy out. Throw, throw punches, okay?
All right, how you doing? How you doing? Good, good. Nice and calm. Nice and calm. How you feeling? All right.
3, 2, 1, go!
Deathmatch. You are authorized to engage. It's a draw. Stand down. Weapon. 
in three. Ling Tacken, sir. Gun down! I'm out. Explosive, get MSD! He's gone. Waypoint out. Transitioning! Enemy down! PG! He's done! Care package on standby. Hostiles have destroyed your equipment. Shot out! Friendly hunter killer drone deployed. Attack reload! Enemy spotted! Friendly care package inbound. Let's go, let's go! Topping off, stand by! Stealth chopper awaiting orders. Stand by for talk on. Contact your mark. Eyes on enemy! Threat neutralized. Point out. Python 1-1, one, one. Fangs out, your target. Target locked. Effects, target That's short. a kill! One DKIA. Enemy down. Package on 
on standby. Friendly care package inbound. Red neutralized. Attacking, sir. Lang Tacken, sir. Shot out. Match. You are authorized to engage. Waypoint out. Attacking, sir. Enemy down. Your man. Kill confirmed. Dry. Going hot. Topping off, stand by. Oh. 
Changing! Escort drone awaiting orders. I'm out! Shot out! Escort drone inbound. Gun down! Come back! Air package inbound. I'm out! He's done. Enemy down. Eyes on enemy. Be advised, your equipment has been destroyed. Escort drone on standby. Stitched him up. Good job, SEALs. Stand by for further orders. <laughs> 